And then last one, uh, you know, people are blowing up the comments here, and, and I want to know, obviously, too, um, Indiana. You know, they just hired Mike Woodson, bring on Thad Mata. Uh, yeah. What are your thoughts about um, that hire and where IU's going? Yeah. Um, you know, I, I was a little bit surprised just because I thought they might go with somebody with um, some – some more college experience coaching wise. And, you know, you pay Archie Miller $10 million in a buyout, which is a lot. <laughs> so, um, you know, coach Woodson, I I've met him a couple times. I worked out for the Clippers and he was an assistant there. So I, I, I've been around him a little bit. Um, he, he is so well respected in, in, in basketball circles and in that NBA um, kind of world. But, um, you know, co coaching in college is so much different than the NBA in the sense of like, you know, if you're an NBA assistant, you, you do some scouts, your main, I think your main job as an assistant in the NBA is to have a good understanding of what your players are going through and kind of being a sounding board for them and, and helping them. Um, because a lot of those guys have been through it. You know, Mike Woodson had, had played in the NBA for a long time and coached yeah. in the NBA for a long time. Um, I think the, the Thad Mata hire is, is, really smart because you need somebody there to kind of help him navigate what this is because in college you're like part basketball coach part academic advisor um part father you know like yeah sure there's, there's a lot of roles you play when you're when you're coaching and you have your own program um so i, I think that him getting good assistance and filling out his staff is going to be really important um, I, I think Juwan Howard kind of opens the door for hires like this to be looked at as, okay, this can be good because he's been so effective at Michigan. Yeah. Uh, but you look at his staff that he hired, like Phil Martelli is a head coach for 27 years at, at St. Joe's. And you bring in Howard Isley, who's um, been an NBA assistant and also, you know, was a really good player in the NBA. And then you, you fill it up with Saudi Washington, who was a beeline assistant and, and considered one of the better assistant coaches in the Big Ten. So um, I think him filling out his staff is going to be important. I, I don't doubt that he'll be terrific X's and O's wise. It's about recruiting. Um, it's about those other things that I talked about where you're just kind of doing stuff outside of basketball. Um, but, you know, I think it's always cool when, when you bring back somebody from their alma mater and they have pride like a Juwan Howard or – or we have with, with Matt Painter, um, because they they want the school to do so well. They have such a, a connection there. And, you know, we'll see. I think time will, will obviously only tell.